Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Skylar, or you can call me Sky. This is my mom. Hi. Say hi. This is the legendary little shoe bird. How does it feel to be a legend? Awesome. In today's video, <clears throat> in today's video, I am going to be vlogging my move-in experience. So for those of you who don't know, I am a rising junior at NC State and this is my third year and I'm finally moving into what I would like to call a big girl apartment. So last year we lived in the apartments that are basically like a hybrid between a dorm and an apartment so it's still on campus and it's still through university housing but we couldn't get back in there this semester so we are moving to apartment or it's not a real apartment it's like college living apartments right sure yeah it's a real apartment okay it's well it's but it's fully furnished that's why I say it's not I'll tell you that <laughs> so it's gonna be an interesting experience um, I moved out all my stuff from our old apartment yesterday and we're about to we're on our way to the new one right now, and so it should be an interesting experience. We've had, to say the least, um, some problems with this apartment complex, but hopefully nothing is wrong when we go into <clears throat> the apartment, so. But if there is, you're gonna see it. <laughs> I'm pretty excited. I'm living with the same people that I lived with the past, okay. One of them I've lived with since I was a freshman, so I've lived with her. This will be our third year living together. <clears throat> and then the other one, this will be our second year. So it's gonna just be us three, me, Allie, and Tana. If you watch my videos, you know who those people are. And so it's gonna be really exciting, and um, yeah, just three best two girls living together, probably just forever. Mom, we're just gonna live together forever. Yeah, sure. Um, we're about, five minutes away from the place so I'm probably gonna stop here. I'm gonna end the vlog here and probably the next time you see me I'll be in the room. Alright guys I'm gonna do a little empty apartment tour because I know some people like that so when you first walk in to the left we have our laundry you can see it's nice you have the shelves which is amazing where we came from we did not have that so this is a nice laundry room i would say and then you walk in there's a little hallway and i'm the first one so this is the um like what you would see if you just look out or look into the door frame and so we have a bug no just one okay thank god <laughs> We have nice wood floors and I have a carpet, so that should be great. Um, and then we have a desk. To the left is the bathroom, which is really nice because at this stage, like getting your own bathroom when you live in an apartment in college is amazing. Here's me. Um, and we have a little nightstand, the bed, which is a standard college bed, I feel like. I have a mattress topper, which should be great. And then we have a nice four tier dresser, which is always a plus, and they seem to have big drawers. And then we have a closet, which is a full length mirror, which is freaking phenomenal because, um, hello, I love just having, I don't wanna buy a real mirror. And then here's the closet, it's nice. It has the little racks right here, which is great because I have a lot of shoes. Um, so this is my room. And then here's the kitchen, a pretty nice kitchen, you know, Whole nine, cabinets, everything, dishwasher, which is amazing. Um, and then here are the other two rooms right there, which are locked. We have a little bar stool, which is great. We have a little table. And then here is the rest. So right now it just came fully furnished. So this is all the furniture it came with. We have a TV stand, um, a little foot, foot table, and another little table. And we have a couch and a little chair which are really cute and nice so that is our living room and then we have a little patio which is cute here's the patio and really nice view of the parking lot that's great some pretty little greenery 
I have no idea what we're gonna put out here, but something. Um, and yeah, that's basically it. I will check back in with you guys in a little bit. Okay guys, I wanted to update you. It's now 6 p.m. So if you've moved in, you know the struggle. You're super excited to amps up about it and then there's like a turning point where you're like, I'm so over this. And so I've been over it for a hot minute. And so I did a lot and now um, me and my friend Maddie just ate. And now I'm back on the grind, but I wanted to show you guys the progress that I've made so far. So let me go ahead and do that. So I'm not gonna cut the light on just because I don't feel like it, but um, I've completely done my closet and everything. I'm really happy with how it turned out. I have so much clothes and most of it, I put like half of it um, in like drawers or in this ottoman that I have, but I was able to fit literally all of it inside my closet and color coordinate it. I'm crazy about that. I really love when stuff is color coordinated and then i have also done all my drawers so this is all my t-shirts and um actually i'm not going to show you everything right now i'm going to wait but i just want to show you the progress i've got my bed made i've got most of the big stuff out of the way now it's just left with like just really unpacking and putting the little things in their place and stuff like that but yeah and i came in and cleaned everything um I don't know. I, I can tell a difference. Like, it looks so good now. I'm so proud. My mom really did that. She got them <laughs> to fix everything. They gave us a new ceiling fan, and they cleaned the floors and the couch and everything. Look how nice this couch is. I really do like it. I fucks with it. So, I'm really excited. I said these were glass. I don't know what in the world my mind was on, but this, these are 100% acrylic, so I don't know where glass came from. This one looks so disgusting. It's literally yellow. But yeah, that is the update as of right now. And yeah, I'm gonna check back in probably in probably an hour or so. I could probably get a lot of this stuff done um, if I could kind of just like grind it out and I've got my energy revitalized. So um, yeah, and I'll probably talk to you guys in like an hour. So, but which will be like one second for you. So whatever. Alright y'all, my hair has progressively gotten worse throughout this video, but um, that's okay. So it's now 9.30 almost, and I have just given up for the day. Like, it's just, I'm calling it a day, and I'm gonna finish everything tomorrow. I'm honestly so tired. I wasn't even gonna record, but I just went ahead and did it. Um, I'm gonna show you, like, the progress I've made, but it's really just... I just cleaned everything up. I haven't made much more progress than that. But yeah, I'm about to show you and then I'm gonna go the freak to sleep, so. All right, so I don't know if you remember what it looked like last time, but basically I just kind of set up majority of the stuff. That's mostly decorations and some other stuff I still have to put away, same with that. But I got my rug down, all my clothes that is made that situation has to be dealt with and so does my desk but yeah the bathroom is clean as well looks pretty good but i will check back in with you guys tomorrow if you can see i have mtv on in the back but i'm gonna go to sleep i've never been so excited to go to sleep in my life and yeah so i'll see you guys tomorrow bye Mwah. all right so it's the next day um, and it's like 2.30 right now. I haven't done much on my room. I've just been chilling, like there's really no rush. So I just got back from Target and home goods. I got, got a whole bunch of stuff um, and I'm about to do a little haul to show you what I got. But I haven't done anything to my room yet. So since I last showed you, so I'm gonna show you what like the next steps are. So this bag, I just got this part basically and so i don't have like in my bathroom all i have is that cabinet and 
and then I have a small medicine cabinet but I have hair products that won't fit in that medicine cabinet that I want to be able to reach without having to go underneath so I got this just so I could put this on this back wall right here right there right there so I got that and I'm gonna use that for that and this is like 20 bucks so not bad for that but I didn't want to buy it but like sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do and then I also got this little drawer organizer, three drawer organizer, um, to put underneath my cabinet because right now everything is literally just thrown in there all astray, which is never good. And then in here I have, oh, I meant to put that hand sanitizer in my car. I got batteries, hand sanitizer, command strips, uh, over the door hook, a candle, which is actually from home goods which is so it's just 13 dollars and it's huge i'm gonna take this off because i think it's so ugly i'm sorry and this too i'm taking both do that one. took that thing off and i don't like this either like that's just ugly to me i don't need a freaking basket holder for this candle you feel me okay i'm not gonna do it right now sorry <laughs> so i got over the door hooks i got another one too so that one's gonna go in my bathroom for my robe and then I have another one. Wait, did I go? Oh, let me sit back here. I have one in here. Um, and then I also have a little over the door thing that goes under your cabinet. So I can put some stuff in there too. So yeah, I'm about to do all that. And I got hangers because I have a garment rack on the way here from Target. I'm going to pick it up in a couple days. So, and I definitely need more hangers for that. So yeah, super excited, super excited. Um, just taking off my Bezos, but um, I'm gonna do some of that stuff and then come back to y'all. Okay, bye. All right, y'all, ignore the Frank Ocean, or don't, I love him. Okay, so I put that together in like 20, 15, 20 minutes. Pretty good, I thought it was gonna be a lot harder than it was, but just a cute little cart. And so I'm excited about that. And the wheels don't really move, which is perfect because I don't want it to be moving everywhere. And then also, you sh I should have shown you before, but this makes it look so much better. Everything that was in, all of that was just thrown everywhere. And everything in the drawers were just like loose and free to move about the cabin. Um, AKA this cabinet. So I'm very happy with the way that this looks now. Like it's just, the clutter is just toned down and that's how I like it. I don't like everything having to be perfect, but um you know just organized chaos so now i'm gonna put all of this on this cart and yeah and then pretty much i can put everything and then i'm gonna do my decorations so this great step for me feel very accomplished by this so i'm about to do this cart and yeah i can decide if i want it right by the shower or right by the door or in the middle i don't know middle 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 yeah, because the door, I'll hit it. And if that, I just don't like it that close to the... Yeah, that's good. Okay, okay. This is hopefully the last check-in. This is going to be the final thing. So I, it's 5 o'clock now. And I have done everything that I need to do in this room for right now. I'm probably, I'm probably not going to do anything else anytime soon. Like, this is going to be kind of like the final... Thing. obviously as I get settled it'll probably change a little bit but I want to go ahead and show you the after of this room okay I'm very excited so obviously this is the doorway and then you come in you can see I have my little grape carpet and I'll just give you a quick little overview of everything I know that there's nothing on that wall, but to be honest, like I don't really know what to put on that wall without it looking kind of weird. So um, it's probably gonna be left blank, but this is what you see. So on the left, you obviously have my bathroom, which I'll go ahead and show you that first. So here we go. And so here's the cart that I did. Very happy about how this turned out. So basically just put toilet paper and then just some random stuff in there. And then all my hair stuff is there. And then bathroom, you kind of saw this a little bit already. Um, that is everything there. I showed you a little bit in there. So all that's organized and hi. So this is pretty much everything for the bathroom. It looks pretty good to me. Um, that's bothering me. 
can't really complain with this. It's so nice having a bathroom in your room. So there's that. And then we come out this way. We have right here is my closet. And then on my dresser, um, let me show you everything in there. We've got my rug, my ottoman, and then there's just like miscellaneous stuff right there that's just gonna stay there. But so I went ahead and put this little thing up. I got this, I'm pretty sure my parents got this maybe from World Market. I don't really know, I can't remember, but they gave it to me as a gift. I also put a little thing right here for my keys just so I can keep them there. On the back door here, on the back door here, I put my fuzzy <laughs> jackets because they're really hard to keep in a closet, so I'd rather just keep them like that. And then I have some belts and purses also over there. And then here's my closet again. I'm so thankful for this full-length mirror. It is amazing. So um, in my closet, it's going to be kind of hard to show you, but I'll take a step back. So this is half. Right here I just have shoes. These are ones that I'm... Um, they are not necessarily my most valued. They're either the ones that I wear the most or the least. So it really just depends. But these are the ones that I can grab really quickly when I need them. And then up top, I have the ones that I value more. So you see my Air Jordan 1s and my Air Jordan Legacies and stuff like that up there. And then let me show you the other side. Here's the other side. So as you can see, everything is color coordinated. And I have another shoe rack right there that is yet to be filled, but I'm sure it will be. And then up here I have more Jordan, some Air Forces, some Converse's, some Adidas, Young 96's, and so on and so forth. And then over here I put my heels back there just because I don't reach for those as much as I reach for my tennis shoes and then here I have jackets and just like miscellaneous sweaters and stuff like that and then everything else is kind of like in those brown containers I have just miscellaneous in that one uh <laughs> what the hell bathing suits in this one and then right there I just have like workout tank tops and then there's my Uggs but um yeah, so I really like how this is organized. It looks really clean. Hopefully I can keep it that way. Who knows though with me. So then right here I just have, that looks kind of awkward, but I'm just going to leave it there because I don't feel like fixing it. Some candles, some miscellaneous, some sage to keep away the bad energy. And then obviously my TV. I'll show you my drawers. So these are my t-shirts. I rolled all of them. God, I do never, I never need to buy another t-shirt ever again. So uh, mark my words, I don't need any more. These are the ones that I wear that are like cute that I wear with my shorts and these are the ones that I sleep in and just kind of lounge around in. And then here I have all my jeans. So all my denim actually. So these are all jeans here. These are jeans here. And then on the bottom I have jeans and on the top these are all my denim shorts because I only have five because I have a pair on. Five pairs so I just rolled them on top. The next one I have... These are all my joggers and sweatpants. I have more too, which is really sad, and they're actually in that. But these are the ones that are a little bit more like breezy and airy. Those are the ones, the ones I have in there are like my ones I would wear in the winter and fall. So <laughs> these are always readily accessible to me because I live in joggers during the fall and the winter and even early spring. And then this one's kind of a mess, but it's leggings and athletic shorts. So I pretty much put all my bottoms in this. That's like that's how I wanted it to be. I wanted this all to be bottoms and then t-shirts on top just so I can have them. And I have so many, it just makes sense. Um, and then all my tops hung up there, stuff like that. And then here I have a floor pillow, which you can't really see because I have book bags on it. But I have floor pillow, backpack, purse. Then right there is another one of those brown little um, containers, like the cubes. And I just have my hangers set in there for right now because I'm getting a um, a garment rack, which I'm probably going to put right there if it'll fit. That's the plan. I'm probably going to put it right there. And those are probably going to end up going on that. So I'm leaving those there for now. Here I have it's just a whole bunch of miscellaneous, but I threw my sheets and stuff on top because I was like running out of space. But that's all like pullovers and hoodies. And then I also have more sweatpants and more hoodies and sweatpants here so i just have a lot of shit a lot of clothes 
and I just I can't even get rid of them so then we have my bed which I just love this is everything should I tell you where I've been getting this stuff from this is from Target from two years ago this is from Costco I think question mark or Amazon I don't know this bedspread is from TJ Maxx or Marshall's TJ Maxx the this also TJ Maxx or Marshalls. This is the best blanket ever. It's this beautiful purple color and it's Calvin Klein. It's amazing. And all this stuff, I didn't buy like anything new. This is all from my dorm from last year, my apartment apartment dorm from last year. And then those are all my pillows and everything. That up there I made. So I just took, I think I spray painted wire. I can't remember if I bought gold wire or spray painted it. I can't remember anymore. And then I just wrap like fairy lights around it and it's a little moon. I love that. Then right here I just have my nightside table. This is from Goodwill. <laughs> Believe it or not. The lamp is Goodwill. That's Marshall's. That's Target. This is Marshall's. I think I took TJ Maxx. I consider them the same, the same thing. But um, it's t that was 10 bucks. But I love this. It's one of my favorite things that I have. And all these pillows, I still can remember. Target, Target, TJ Maxx, Urban Outfitters. This one was like five bucks. It was on sale. And these gray ones, this gray one, I have two. Those are from Steinmart. Crazy. Those are from Steinmart. And they per fit perfectly with my theme. This curtain, I believe, is from TJ Maxx. Um, don't quote me on that, but yeah. This was a gift from my parents, and I have no idea, but I love it so much. And it's just a little hanging collapsible um lantern i don't know why it took me so long to do that and then here i have my desk You're, like i know that this is a like random space but i'm really hoping i'm getting i have a garment rack from target coming and i'm really hoping it's gonna fit in that corner this way i know it's not gonna fit this way actually it might i think i'm underestimating this space right here i think i really am but garment rack is gonna go there most likely because I just need one to organize when I do like videos and stuff, so I just really need one. And it'll just create space also, just like being because I'll be able to put stuff on the bottom too. Then here's my desk. I don't like how this is flipped. Here's my desk and nothing crazy here. Um, just very simple. Like this is from Target. I just have a whole bunch of like miscellaneous pictures and stuff. I had more, but they fell off and I don't feel like putting them on. That's from Target. That was from like the home. Like the college section of that this is from society six um the mirror is from costco question mark i keep saying question mark <laughs> that right there is from anthropology and those are just some fake flowers i've had for forever the sign the neon sign which is beautiful by the way i love that i got that on sale from marshall's last year room spray is from marshall's that picture frame is from marshall's um both of those, the, uh, shoot, why am I slurring my words? The, um, frick, <laughs> the little gold wire cup is from Target, and then the one beside it is from TJ Maxx or Marshall. Same thing with the acrylic drawer. Um, this right here is from Earthbound. I'm obsessed with this. I need to put my rings on them. They're packed away right now, but I'm obsessed with that. I love it so much. Like the rings on it looks so cute. And then this is from Marshall's little thing. Um, and yeah, that, I think I went through everything. Oh, I just, I just bought this candle. And by the way, it smells incredible, guys. This looks like an uh, anthropology candle, but it's not. This is from Marshall's. This is from Bath and Body Works. This is from Goodwill, the picture frame. This is from Target on sale. That I was, that was a gift from somebody to me i think i told you where everything was from i'm really a baller on a budget so nothing was very expensive this little fur fake fur rug which is honestly looking it's had better days but i got this for five dollars at marshall's last summer so i really didn't buy any new decorations only storage um let me see did i tell you everything i told you that was from target so yeah that's pretty much everything guys i'm gonna just talk to you in this mirror really quick yeah, this is pretty much everything. I'm really happy with how it turned out. This is like a real room. So where I came from, the little dorm thing that I was staying in was not a real room. And it just, I could, it just did not feel homey. But this really does. It's so cute. I can't wait to get that corner fixed. It's really bugging me that there's nothing there. It's just an empty corner.
and my desk is so far away from it, but it's whatever. Um, all the furniture came in this room. I think I said this already. It was fully furnished, but really love this so much, you guys. I love how this turned out. I hope you enjoyed it. I know there's a lot of gray, like gray, gray. <laughs> the furniture is kind of gray, but I don't really mind it. I have pops of color, like my whole theme. I pretty much kept the theme that I had from last year and just carried it on. I think this gray, purple, and then pops of green. So if you can see here, purple and green, there's a little bit of green in that, the green there, and just purple and stuff like that. And then all the hardware, I like to be gold, pretty much. So you got gold, gold, gold door handles. <laughs> I'm just playing. But yeah, that's pretty much everything. I'm really happy with how this turned out. And I'm so excited to live here, but yeah. I'm not going to show you the common area just because just because um, it's not done and I don't feel like showing you so I'll show you another time where you can see in another video but I just want to say thank you guys so so much for watching if you made it through this entire video it's probably very choppy if you made it through this entire video you're a saint and I love you so much and I'll see you guys next time